I just, black girl magic, okay? channel so today I'm going to be doing my hair one of the things that I love doing is I love getting back to my natural hair I love getting back to my natural root and I just love dressing my hair up trying to make myself feel beautiful in my natural hair because ever since I started wearing wigs listen I started feeling like a little girl with my natural hair but natural hair is beautiful either way so what I'm doing today is I'm going to dry try Ooh, girl get your language together I'm trying today is I'm gonna blow out my hair and then I'm gonna do a twist out with that just to see how it looks I've seen another person do it on YouTube and it turned out beautifully so that's what I want to try to do today hopefully it turns out great because I will cry if it does not I will literally drop down on the floor and start crying for those who you know you know how it is. So I've already washed my head, as you can see with the towel on my head. Now I'm going to comb it out and blow dry it. Also add, you know, the heat protectant and everything. I am not a professional. I'm not a professional. So if I do anything wrong or you see any mistakes, please let me know. Please drop, drop something down in the comments below just to inform me. So let's get started. <music> Personally for me, I don't like my hair too moist when I'm getting ready to blow dry it. So right now I'm just pat drying it with a towel. That way when I do get ready to blow dry my hair, it's not going to be too dry yet not too moist. huge tip when you're blow drying your hair with an attachable comb find a headband and wrap it around the tip of the comb and at the bottom of the blow dryer that way when you're blow drying your hair with the comb it will not pop off i hate when it pops off so this way it stays on and it saves you a ton of time and it saves you from getting upset and wanting to cut your hair off step I'm gonna part my hair into four parts two in the back two in the front that way when I get ready to comb it out it's not gonna be that hard so now I'm gonna comb out my hair the most important part is to remember to start at the bottom and work your way up never start from the top and work your way to the bottom that's just gonna cause a lot of breakage and a lot of pulling Before I start to blow dry, I am going to go in with my heat protectant. I bought this heat protectant from Walmart, so it wasn't that expensive. I'm also going to be using Blue Magic Grease, and I'm also going to be using Canvas Hair Growth Oil. After I apply the heat protectant, I blow my hair out and then after that I apply the blue magic as well as the hair growth oil. I do this to each section and I just repeat the process.
to be parting it again two in the front and two in the back just as a reminder i am also going to be using the camille rose twisting butter unfortunately i didn't show it in the video but that is the product that i'm using so now with each section i'm not going to use too much product because i don't want to lose that blown out effect but with each section i'm going to apply the product and then i'm going to braid it down Also with the back, even though the back is parted into two, I also part those again into four. That way I can have those braids more defined as well. skin i don't know why but i have just been breaking out breaking out breaking out and that's usually unusual so now we're gonna take out our braids oh this is gonna turn out cute oh my gosh i'm gonna be so hurt if it turns out bad i probably should get a mirror no okay okay that's that's not that's not bad that's not bad but it's giving me a regular it's giving me a regular length blowout i mean not blowout but a regular length braid out and i don't like that <gasps> i hope it didn't we're gonna find out
And like I mainly did it in different sections because I was afraid that, hold on. Okay, this is not turning out how I thought it would, but it's still cute. Your girl is still gonna do what she gotta do. It's still cute. Like it's giving, um, with the outfit, it's giving classy. Ooh. Don't wanna show y'all too much. It's giving classy girl, like an, an older, 90s type of look even though we used to not show too much skin but it's giving that type of look yeah and i kept this in all day maybe it's just really flat see i probably should have followed her instructions but you know me i never follow instructions i hope it stays like this because you know how blown out here is when you're like out in the sun and you're out and about it kind of just tends to shrink like, yeah. But this side is cute. This side is giving. <gasps> it's still not giving, but it's like, on me, what I'm thinking is like, this is gonna, my pictures are still gonna turn out cute. Because even though it's not giving what I wanted it to give, I can still like work with it. You know what? I just, uh, I just, black girl magic, okay? Black girl magic, I just, black girl beauty, natural hair, I just, it's all coming to me right now. I, I... Black women. Mm -hmm. Loved how this turned out, y'all. This is like super, super cute. And with my outfit, it's just giving me vibes. I just hope that it stays like this. I hope that it doesn't shrink, but I love it. And I recommend you guys to try it. I would say though, keep it in for like probably an extra day as mine is not as fluffy as I wanted it to be, but it's still super cute. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I appreciate every single view. I am at 109 subscribers and I continue and I hope to continue going up from there and I am super grateful and I thank God for every single step of the way. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all and have a great day. So for the honest truth, my hair did not stay like that the rest of the night. Once I stepped outside, poof, it was gone after like I would say 30 minutes, but I still looked cute. I still look cute. That's all that matters. So I would still try this style. Maybe take your videos and pictures while you're inside before you step out. But either way, it was still a cute hairstyle.